Welcome back. The end of March marks the end of an era in one community. The building inspector in Spring Lake Park is retiring. We got a chance to catch up with him before he hangs up the hard hat for good. A walk through a construction site with Barry Brainard is like a step into his classroom. Each step along the way is a chance for him to find a way to make what he sees better. My job is to make sure they comply with the code, make sure they, they comply with minimum codes and safety, but yet not to abstract from their progress to sometimes I have to uh, instruct and, and teach them why the codes are this way, the purpose and reasons for them, and uh, it's, been, uh, it's been fun. It's been 35 years in Barry's case, first in Circle Pines in Lexington, and for the last 19 years in Spring Lake Park. It's an honor. Uh, I love uh, working for citizens. Uh, they're, uh, I, I try to prove every day that, I, that uh, the taxpayer's money is, is going to good work. Um, being that for 35 years, uh, just 19 years here, I've probably been in almost everybody's home what, at one time or another doing some type of an inspection. He's also spent a fair bit of time inspecting big projects like schools and grocery stores. He's also had to be a code enforcer, whom some may think of as the bad guy. Nobody likes to be told that they're doing something wrong, that they're, they, they've been parking their vehicle on the grass for 30 years and all suddenly it's being enforced that they're not supposed to. Nobody likes to be told that and it's, it's, it's frustrating on both my end and on their end. And that has been the most difficult aspect of this job. But Brainard said the best part has been interacting with people on the job sites, be it contractors or laborers or weekend warriors. You get to work with a lot of people who do it yourselfers that are trying to do projects, you know, and uh, you get to work with those people and you get to know them. And, uh, I really enjoyed that. But now it's time to take the know-how to a different arena. To step out into the private service is a little scary, but uh, I'm looking forward to the challenge. By continuing to look up, down, and all around. The city of Spring Lake Park held a retirement party for Barry on March 29th. He'd also previously worked for the city of Blaine when he was a student at Centennial High School.